Um, so there, here's the big old, big old Docker run command. So we'll just fire it up. Um, it downloads it from Docker Hub. It actually builds a kernel module on the fly that matches your running um, kernel version. This is just like uh, uh, sysdig, so this part's the same. Okay, so now it's running. In this case, it's running in the foreground. You can see the output that it's all ready to go. So the first thing we'll do is let's try um, let's try you know writing something to uh, blow bin directory. So in this case, we'll just try to touch a file bin hacker. Maybe maybe a real hacker wouldn't use such an obvious name, but you know. Um, I'm not that smart. Okay, so we do that, and you can see in the Falco output, it noticed that activity and sent a alert based on it. So it said, um, here's the message. It said, a file below a known binary directory was opened for writing. And then we have information on um, who it was, what the command was, and what the file they were trying to write. So that's pretty good. You know, we're already detecting bad activity. Um, let's actually, just to see what the rules file looks a little bit more. So here's the actual Falco rules file. Um, so we already looked at one rule in the uh, slide deck, but you know here's the actual set of rules that are in the product right now. So here's the rule that was just triggered. So it's write binary dir, we have a description. Um, here's the condition that says what, the, what activity it was looking for. Um, and the output, and so the the way it plugged in that stuff about root and the command was based on these fields right here. So looking at the username, the command line. So the output field is kind of nice. It's you know it's a nice mix of a good description, and then you can pull out the interesting information out of the event and put that together. 